Hello, it's Corner Shop Curry here, and welcome to another Minecraft video. So today, I'm going to be doing a tutorial on how you can change the textures in a texture pack in Minecraft. So, um, if you saw my last video, I showed you how you could swap out uh, a block in a texture pack uh, for a different block in another texture pack, if that makes sense. So, to give a quick example, this is a stone texture for Minecraft. Um, in this texture pack, which is the turtles 50k pack. So if I wanted to, if I didn't like this texture and I wanted to swap it out for another stone texture that I already like, um, say the default one, then I showed you guys how to do that um, last video. So yeah, hopefully it was easy to understand. And if you have any questions about that, um, be sure to ask me in the comment section of that video. But anyway, this video. So instead of just swapping out the texture uh, with another texture from a different texture pack, take this sandstone block, all right? Say I didn't really like the sandstone block at all, but there was no sandstone block in any other texture pack that I liked either. So I would just wanna make my own sandstone block, make it my own texture and customize it myself. And that's actually really simple to do and I'll show you how to do it right now. So all you have to do is you go Options, resource pack, and open up the resource pack folder. Then, so as you can see, I'm using the Oceana 16x texture pack. So let's go Oceana 16x. Then we go assets. Oh, and quickly, sorry. You want to make sure that the texture pack folder is not a zip file. So if it's a zip file, then you, you're going to need to extract it. So to do that, all you have to do is right click and press there should be an extract button somewhere here so you want to make it so as you can see this yellow folder and you can open it up so then what you do is you go into assets minecraft textures and then so we want to change the sandstone block right so the sandstone block will be in blocks so now we have all the textures for every single block in minecraft so then what we want to do is it's in alphabetical order so we just scroll down until we find s so there's here we go sandstone normal there we go so here is the file now all we have to do is we right click we press um open with and we go paint.net now if you don't have paint.net you can use gimp or paint or any of these but i would really recommend just installing paint.net it's, it's free you can just download it from the internet it's safe there's it's not a dodgy it's not a dodgy one so uh, yeah um once you have that installed then make sure you then click open with paint.net so here we go it's a bit tiny here so we just need to scroll in how you do that um is you can press control and scroll in with your mouse wheel so here we go that's really that's really it so now you can do whatever you want so you know if i wanted to so here here's this color so now i've picked this color and you know maybe i wanted to uh make it so that it was just smooth so then that's all you do so yeah you can really go crazy you can do whatever you like you can become a pro texture pack maker <laughs> by doing this so yeah i mean i'm not doing this seriously so i'm just gonna um sorry i'll pick that color and i'll just draw a smiley face so yeah that's basically it and now all you have to do is make sure you go save uh, sorry file save as and then make sure it's the exact same name as it was before and you want to save it in this texture pack folder so it should come up with sandstone underscore normal or whatever block you have already exists now if it doesn't come up with this then you've probably changed the file name by accident or something you just need to make sure that the file name is the same as the block you're changing so there we go you say yes um okay now if we go back into minecraft and you'll see it's not there oh sorry that's m stone You'll see it's not there yet so what you have to do is you just have to reload the textures so to do that you hold f3 and you press t 
and now as you can see it's frozen it's just taking a few seconds to reload minecraft it, it depending on how fast your system is it might take five ten seconds maybe more but not too long so just wait a bit for this and there we go there is our changed sandstone textures nelly that looks lovely but anyway as you can see you can go crazy do whatever you want and you can change it until your heart's content so yeah that was just a quick tutorial on how to do it obviously it can become more complicated but yeah if you have any questions be sure to ask me you can do this for any block you just have to find the file um for it in the resource pack folder so yeah that's literally it and if this helps you out please be sure to share it with others so it can help them out too and yeah if you enjoyed it uh please let me know in the comments but yeah that's basically it so thanks for watching and i'll see you all in the next one